PolyU's research excellence has made an impact not only on Hong Kong, the nation and the world, but also beyond our planet. We have lent our expertise in precision engineering and topographic mapping to several of China's space missions. We are the only tertiary institution in Hong Kong that has gained international space exploration experience, and we have been contributing to the nation's ambitions to be a space powerhouse since the 1990s. In collaboration with the China Academy of Space and Technology, PolyU has contributed to China's Chang'e 3, 4 and 5 missions to the Moon and the Tianwen-1 mission to Mars, helping to design and manufacture space instruments and identify landing sites. But these opportunities also came with cosmic challenges. Our design had no references at the beginning. We had to investigate conditions such as space weather and the possible challenges that the spacecraft might encounter during launch, cruising through space and landing. The Chang'e's five mission required the unprecedented use of robotics to collect lunar samples under an extreme environment. The Tianwen-1 Mars mission necessitated a surveillance camera to capture ultra-wide angle images on Mars. PolyU's pioneering industrial center was pivotal to developing these sophisticated space instruments. For the surface sampling and packing systems for Chang'e of this, there were over 400 components. The design required making the system tough, rigid, lightweight, and aesthetically acceptable. This was a very challenging feat. Nevertheless, the industrial center's expertise and willingness to embrace innovative ideas made it well qualified to produce space instruments. For over a decade, Professor Wu Bo has been instrumental in identifying critical landing sites for the lunar and Mars missions. His integrated 3D mapping modeling techniques have proven to be essential for evaluating terrain surfaces to ensure they meet landing safety requirements. We amassed a large amount of lunar remote sensing data from multiple sources to create high precision and high resolution topographic models of the landing region. We then analyzed in detail the terrain slopes, terrain occlusions to sound illumination and tiny communication crater distribution and the rock abundances. For the ambitious Chen 11 Mars mission, Professor Wu's team, with the aid of AI-based techniques, had only about two months to map and analyze numerous craters, rocks and volcanic cones distributed over the target landing region. They finally identified several areas with optimal engineering safety and scientific importance for the lander. The Jurong rover successfully landed in the landing ellipse the team had suggested as their first choice. In terms of applying space technologies back on Earth, Professor Wu envisions his 3D mapping and modeling techniques can be applied to urban innovations and smart city development. The precision instruments developed by Professor Jung and his team also offer promising opportunities for enabling advancements in medical science and other areas, ultimately benefiting humanity.